Today is a day of celebration and joy as we, the Epsilon class of Green Valley College, prepare for commencement. I am Elizabeth Leber. On behalf of our class, I welcome Ms. Tara Dean, Director of the Special Academic Program, and Michelle Goodwin Calloway, Linda Levantis Wells, Glenda Morrison Fair, and Dr. Ann Presley. Our distinguished boards members of the Greenville County School District Board of Trustees. Welcome beloved family, friends, and members of our school community that are here to support us today. This group of students has been here since the sixth grade in the University Center. And today we celebrate the conclusion of a chapter and the beginning of a new one. Next we'll have a poem read by Jada Sullivan. As we celebrate today, we want to begin with the poem by Lucille Clifton called May This Be a House of Joy. May this be a house of joy. May we be open here to dreams and to each other. May all who enter in these magic walls feel love and feel respect for learning and for each other. May we always be friends for life. May we walk in that friendship. May learning live in this house. May it never leave. Hi, everybody. First, I want to say thank you for um, the last minute adjustment. But if you turn around and look, you'll see why. Um, these children that we're here to celebrate today have done a tremendous job of just setting the record straight. They have grown and matured. They have led us. They have guided us. They've encouraged us. And they have allowed us to do great things with them. And so today, I'm excited that you all are here with us. Um, I, this is the group I came in with, and so um, it's a wonderful opportunity for us to celebrate them and to hear all about their wonderful accomplishments. At this time, I want to take a few minutes to recognize those accomplishments of our students. They continue to demonstrate creativity, collaboration, civic mindedness, <clears throat> career readiness, and a desire to be college bound. As we highlight some of their successes this year, please stand and receive applause for your work, students. First, the Student Advisory Council is a group of students nominated to serve as the voice for their peers. Several of their responsibilities this year included serving as representatives of the Superintendent's Inner High Council. These students will receive, have already received certificates with a diploma recognizing their hard work this year. Please stand when your name is called. Anaya Ashmore and Tyler James. Thank you. The definition of resilience is the ability to withstand or recover quickly from difficult conditions. There are times when students experience setbacks within a project or class, and it takes resilience for them to recover from that setback and continue to challenge themselves. Each year, we recognize students that have demonstrated resilience in the pursuit of their dreams. This year, we recognize Wilson Willard. Please stand. Each year, civic and community organizations partner with Greenville County Schools and recognize the efforts of the students in a variety of ways. The following students have earned recognition from four distinguished organizations within the Greenville community. We will recognize each student and the organization celebrating them at this time. Jada Sullivan and Wilson Willard are Greenville Early College's Coaches for Character Award winners. This award is given to two students who are considered unsung heroes. Anaya Ashmore, Javius Burton, Cameron Garrison, Shania Hun, Elizabeth Ledbetter, and Jada Sullivan, all are students. Ready to go. All right. <laughs> who are members of our National Beta Club. They have given over 1,000 hours in community service. 
Oh, excuse me, and Destiny Haygood. I didn't mean to forget you, Destiny. Um, they also coordinated our school's first blood drive. We have two students who participate as scholars within the Bridges to a Brighter Future program here at Furman University. This is a four-year college access program before they tr transition to crossing the bridge where Bridges will continue to support them as college students. The two students from this class are Shakaria Benson and Shania Hun. <laughs> students selected to participate in Bridges to a Brighter Future must demonstrate resiliency as well as a true desire to attend college. So congratulations, students. And last but surely not least, <clears throat> again, we want to recognize Tyler James and Anaya Ashmore for their work as leaders within our program and representatives for the superintendent's inner high council. In 2015, Dr. Royster and the Greenville County Schools began to redefine the profile of the South Carolina graduate with the implementation of Graduation Plus. The G Plus framework expects students to graduate with a high school diploma plus college credit and a state or national certification in a specific career field. The following students were able to participate in college classes at Greenville Tech and or Donaldson Career Center. Additionally, several students participated in enough courses to be considered career completers as designated at the state level, including one in the fine arts. When your name is called, please stand. Jamari Abercrombie. <laughs> Jamari's certification is the OSHA 10, and he has 11 hours of dual credit in the area of mechatronics. Anaya Ashmore. <laughs> Anaya has the microburst certification as well as 32 hours of dual credit from Greenville Tech, which she will take with her to the University of South Carolina. <laughs> Shakaria Benson. She also has the microburst certification as well as 16 hours of dual credit, which she will also take with her to USC Upstate. <laughs> Javius Burton. <laughs> His certifications include the OSHA 10, machine tool technology, microburst certification, and 12 hours of dual credit. Christian Diego. Christian has 10 hours of dual credit in aircraft maintenance, a silver on the wind ready to work assessment. Cameron Garrison. Cameron Garrison has the OSHA 10 certification, the microburst certification, a gold on the wind ready to work assessment, 32 hours of dual credit, both in college and mechatronics. <laughs> Brian Guerrero. <laughs> Brian has 12 hours of university transfer dual credit from Greenville Tech. Destiny Haygood, Microsoft certification, micro bird certification, gold on the win ready to work assessment and 19 hours of dual credit. Shania Hun, micro bird certification, silver on the win readiness to work assessment, 12 hours of dual credit with some acquired through her time as a student at the Fine Arts Center. Tyler James, microburst certification and a silver on the win ready to work assessment. 
Joshua Ruiz also has a silver on the win readiness to work assessment. Great job. Jada Sullivan, microburst certification and silver on the win readiness to work assessment. Jada is also our top award winning scholar. She has received over $469,000 in scholarship. And and was accepted to a record 19 colleges and universities. Deshaun Watson has the OSHA 10 and the Machine Tool Technology Certification. And last but certainly not least, Wilson Willard has three hours of dual enrollment coursework in diesel technology as well as the OSHA 10 certification. In addition to these and a host of other academic awards not mentioned here today, these 16 students have earned $5.2,973,000 in scholarship and aid. We will now have a video presentation from the graduation committee. Please forgive me, in, in my stuck pages, I missed one of my children and I would dare not do that. We also have Elizabeth Ledbetter who has 23 hours of dual credit, was the president of our beta club and will be going to, where are you going Elizabeth? Lander University. She also has the micro birth certification Please accept my humble apologies, my dear. You know you did a job. Well done. Families, we acknowledge that this honor is for both the student and the commitment you all have made to support them. As each graduate's name is called, we ask that all those that are here to support them, please stand so that we can celebrate with you as well. With the first world graduates, please stand and prepare to receive your diploma.
Jamari, Ty James, Levante, Abercrombie. Anaya, Anaya Nicole Ashmore. Shakaria Namijie Niangel Benson. Javius Antonio Burton. Jennifer Vasquez Diaz. Christian Ruben Diego. Cameron Terrell McDuffie Garrison. Brian Guerrero Ramirez. Destiny Kalia Hager. Shania Therese Lily Hunt.
Tyler Savoy James. Elizabeth Gabrielle Ledbetter. Joshua Alonzo Ruiz. Jada Simone Sullivan. Wilson Balin Willard. Distinguished guest, Mrs. Ford, Mrs. Dean, I present to you the Epsilon class of the Greenville Early College Program for the confirmation of their diplomas. First of all, I think there, there are many people here that are supporting this Epsilon class, and I want our graduates to thank your parents, your grandparents, your aunts, your uncles, your sisters, and all your family and friends, because without them, you would not be here today. Thank y'all. <laughs> also over here to my left is a great staff at Greenville Early College. I've been in most of your classrooms and see what you do and how you care for our students. Thank you for what you did to get them here. So, congratulations to all the Greenville Early College graduates. I would like to thank Ms. Ford and the staff for all the time and effort that you put in over the years. Thank you, Board of Trustees, for supporting this program. I think you can see it made a difference in these children's lives. <clears throat> to the graduates, I know that you all have been through many struggles this past year and in future past years because of pandemic, but you've made it. You have persevered and you have achieved. 
take this same grit with you to your future. Because guess what? Life doesn't get a whole lot easier. But you've got what it takes. You've got grit. You've got perseverance. And you will continue to be successful. Miss Ford, I confirm that the students presented today have completed all the necessary requirements established by the Board of Education to be considered graduates of Greenville County Schools. By the power and the responsibility given to me by the Superintendent of Greenville County Schools and the Board of Trustees, I now confirm the diplomas presented today. Students at this time, please stand and move your tassels from the right to the left. Congratulations. <laughs> trustees that have joined us today. We appreciate your commitment to education to the support of us. Thank you teachers and members of the early college family, past and present, that have taught us, encouraged, and supported us on this journey. Thank you parents, grandparents, and family and friends that have loved us and been there for us from the beginning. To the Epsilon class, thank you for the memories, the stories, the dreams that we have shared. Thank you for celebrating with us today. Please stand as we recite our creed. Well, students, but y'all can stand too. Come on. I am fearless. I can do anything I put my mind to because I know hard work pays off. I have goals to reach and dreams to fulfill. My challenges are a stepping stone to a better me. Because I believe in myself, I will achieve great things. You should see my future. I am success waiting to happen. You may be seated. Again, congratulations to the Epsilon class of Greenville Early College. We are excited for you and wish you well. Thank you parents, families, and staff for all of your hard work with our students. Audience members, please remain seated as our, great, as our graduates exit the room.